Oh, don't take it too hard, loser. <laughs> hey, call your mom and have her come pick you up. Warm. And welcome to another episode of Carbs, the only show where I sit in the car and BS while consuming carbs. Mad sign here. How you guys doing? How's life? It's good to see you again. We are back for day two of the Jack in the Box journey. This is their $1 loaded breakfast croissant stick by Hot Pockets. So this is a collaboration with Hot Pockets directly, which I was not expecting uh, to see in the slightest. All right, so Thrillist says, the new $1 loaded breakfast croissant stick by Hot Pockets features uh, pieces of bacon, scrambled eggs, and cheese all wrapped in a deep fried flaky croissant pastry. Cool, I mean, is this, I, I imagine this is probably just the Hot Pocket that they sell on the market, right? Oh, no it is not. No, it is not. I was, it's, let me look at it. It's not nearly the size that a Hot Pocket would be. It's not even close. It's very like gangly and thin and long. Very similar to uh, every single time that my penis has been put into the face of a woman. She's like, where's the girth? And I go, you know what? I asked Jesus that I don't believe in the exact same question every single night. Nice. All right, we're gonna break this thing in half. Uh, limb by half. Yeah, there we go. I was gonna say, well, I wasn't gonna be able to get it for a second. Okay, I don't want the whole thing. A dollar, by the way, though, great value. Great value. You're gonna get a lot of stoners that are just gonna grab this thing along with their stoner menu, which is their best thing they have. There you go. It doesn't look particularly filled, just like uh, my love life. Here we go. That is, wow, that is not very good. Oh man, that is strange. It, it doesn't have nearly enough stuff on the inside. The main two issues though are, it basically just tastes like the oil that they deep fried it in, which is a very common mistake when you make stuff like this. I know uh, if you watch Colt Moose channel, they talk about it a lot. You, you don't wanna leave it in too long because you're gonna soak up too much of the oil and some of the times when they do deep fried what, it happens. The other complaint is, hey flavor, yo. Where are you at? <laughs> it literally just tastes like cooking oil. It doesn't taste like anything else. Uh, it's just very like doughy. It just, it, it's very unpleasant. And for a dollar, I'm not that mad. <laughs> it's, only, it's only a dollar. Most people are gonna get this. They're gonna be the stoners that get this. You know, again, as a compliment to whatever they're normally getting. Oh man, that is no good. That is no good. It is so oily. Oh, it's all I taste is just oil, oil, oil. God, that's like when Homer was collecting the Home Simpson was collecting the oil off of uh, what that one geek's like face when he was ordering a burger or something. I don't remember. My the memory's terrible. Simpsons reference. Uh, if you're gonna get one of the two items that I reviewed, you know, today or yesterday, the tacos. Get the tacos. Tacos are actually delicious. Um, they're still holding up. And if I was wasn't trying to uh, eat better. Uh, I would eat the rest of those, but instead, they're gonna go in the trash. And I know people are gonna go, you're wasting food! Mm, I, I would argue I'm keeping myself alive longer, which is more important than wasting food. Uh, but, I'm gonna rate that a incredibly disappointing one out of five matte faces. I wouldn't even eat that Hot Pocket croissant item from Jack in the Box. I wouldn't even eat it if I was drunk. Uh, I would not. It would It would definitely take zombie apocalypse for me to eat that again, ever. Like, just, it's no good, unfortunately. Good tacos, though. Tacos are amazing. And either way, that's that. And let me ask you this while the sun awkwardly sh shines right into my face. What is an item you'd like to see Jack in the Box add to their stoner menu? So, stoner menu, if you don't know, is their midnight menu, even though you can get it all day. And it's always like chicken nuggets dipped in ranch and cheese and Margaret Thatcher naked on a cold day. But essentially, like, you can just make your, your you know, dream drunk slash stoner food. What would you have them make? Uh, you know, do your best concoction down below in the comments. Uh, and, but keep in mind, it's Jack in the Box. You gotta keep it Jack in the Box themed. But either way, that's that. Thank you for watching. Appreciate you guys so much. And we'll see you on the next episode. Bye. <laughs> And introducing the champion. <laughs> this is fantastic. Bad man from New York, weighing in at 220 pounds. <laughs> this is so he good. Is the European champion. Bad <laughs> man. And introducing the champion, accompanied by Bad <laughs> Man from New York, weighing in at 220 pounds. He is the European champion, Bad <laughs> Man. And introducing the What's champion, happening? accompanied by Bad <laughs> Man. From New York, weighing in at 220 pounds. He is the European champion. <laughs>
music stuck in a loop? <laughs> and introducing the champion, accompanied by Batman <laughs> from New York, weighing in at 220 pounds. He is the European <sighs> champion. <Capri> <laughs> Breathe. <laughs> Holy shit. All of this just works.